three rides done, done, and done. So let's count them up. We had Revenge of the Mummy. That was fun. Probably the best indoor coaster I've ever been on. I'll have a review on that in a few days. Then I think we did Rip Ride Rocket. Now that is cool. Onboard audio synced up to the ride. Great idea. A little rough, but manageable. Then the last ride I just did was Race Through New York starring Jimmy Fallon. That is really cool. I gotta admit, I am not like 100% angry at this park. I thought it would just be all simulators. It really isn't. It's more than that. And even the simulators, they're crazy. Like, Race Through New York, that was pretty immersive. And the way they have it designed is so unique. <laughs> Sorry. For anyone who doesn't know, they have a color-coded card system. Like, they'll give you a card, or a color card, and then when the outside lights around you turn that color, that's when your group gets to go. Like, it's a bunch of people sitting in a the theater that kind of has actuators on it, but Race to New York has a good kind of grid system with it. I like it. And in a few minutes, I am going to be putting up Fear Factor Live. And I think this is going to be my one and only chance to see the show before it goes away. Because I heard they're probably going to take it out and replace it with something. I don't know if it's really going to happen, but it's rumored. It's not long for this world, but I might as well just give it a shot. Alright, so... Stay tuned for Fear Factor Live, because that is going to do be dope. So, I've been Madman24, you've been you, and as always, just for this part of the vlog, thanks for watching.